All right. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Brian from KHex Nation, and for today's episode, we're going to be going over the new medals that we just recently got in Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Now, TLDR, they're basically the exact same thing as the Kingdom Hearts 3 Aqua Medal uh, that we received in VIP these last couple of weeks. It's just the power and speed version. So we basically just got the Supernova Kingdom Hearts 3 Terra as well as Supernova Kingdom Hearts 3 Ventus. They're quite literally almost exactly the same thing as Aqua. Yeah, there she is. <laughs> as Aqua, I pressed that by accident. As Aqua, just the power and speed versions. And if you're not already aware, Aqua herself is very meta. She's one of the meta medals at the moment. Okay, she's, she's very good for mono magic setups, regardless of whether or not the reverse or upright. Um, and now that we have both the speed and power version in the game, you could almost argue that you don't even need Kairyoshio. <laughs> to be honest, you could almost argue you don't need him. Quite literally, the only thing that makes Kairi or Shion viable is the fact that their supernova provides a plus 5,000 uh, strength buff and can also work for multi-attribute setups. Whereas uh, the Terra Ventus Aqua Metals can work for any, any mono-colored setup uh, and can also work last for multiple turns, whereas the Supernova for Kyrie and Shion only lasts for one turn. Okay, so that's kind of the trade-off. Personally, for me, I would much rather value the uh, the multi-turn medals. I don't mean to press these. The multi-turn setups, or medals, I mean, because uh, they're a lot more consistent. And you'll probably end up getting more value over them throughout... Um, more often so but aside from that in terms of the banners themselves because of the fact that they are 10 mercy pulls oh and just throwing it out there as well for the free-to-play banners the grayed out ones okay makes a very clear manipulative they don't want you to pull on this they want you to go for the the, the vip uh, but for the free-to-play banners, they don't tell you, but it's a mercy pull. Well, they kind of do, but it's not obvious on the picture art itself. But it's only a mercy pull amongst, like, three or four medals. Uh, Zeus, Master Xehanort, and Terra or Ventus. It's, or, you know, Terra for the Terra one. And I think for Ventus, it, let's say right here. Uh, Guardian Form Sora, Kingdom Hearts 3 Lee or Ventus himself. So it's basically out of one, th you have a chance of getting one of three medals from the free to play uh, banner, which isn't really worth it in my opinion, okay? Um, even for the VIP banners where you're guaranteed to get it within 10 pulls, well, they're both a guaranteed at 10 pulls, but free to play is a guaranteed out of three medals. So it's not really guaranteed. For the VIP banners, you're guaranteed the, the advertised medal in 10 pulls. However, and the first pull is free too as well, I should add. But in my opinion, I'm not too sure if it's worth getting this for that amount. Granted, they're falling price deals, so it's not too bad. I think it only costs a total of around maybe 20,000 jewels, more or less, uh, off the top of my head, rather than an entire 30,000 jewels, so that's a plus. But, I don't know, I, I'm st I still kind of don't think it's worth it. That's just my gut feeling. I just don't think it's worth it. it like, because quite literally the only reason why these medals are meta is for those strength buffs they provide. But at the current rate that they're going at, you can I can almost say guarantee that they're just going to make more medals like, what? next week two weeks from now <laughs> i do the exact same thing that they do if not better so i yeah i'm kind of finicky about it chances are they might print reverse copies uh of these medals as well maybe considering like the the 358 days trio maybe do like a roxas shion axel version that did the exact same thing but they're just reverse versions 
very easily could be like that. And who knows, maybe the banners end up being uh, better if, if that ends up being the case. But overall, I don't really feel like they're completely worth it, in my opinion. Almost. Uh, but if you do go chasing for them, they're going to be very useful because uh, they are definitely in the meta as of right now. Stop. But other than that, that was just my thoughts about it and opinions. Go ahead and let your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, and hit that bell button. It's the best way I know when I upload more videos such as this one. My name is Brian from KHX Nation, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace, guys.